Let's continue with the NBA. The Orlando Magic reportedly fielding calls from teams for a deal for power forward Serge Ibaka. Ibaka on an expiring deal, so it shouldn't take too much to pry him from the Magic. Dylan, when you look at the NBA landscape, who do you might feel would be a good fit for the big man? I'm going to say, how about Houston? Okay. And I, I look at a Houston team that's very good. They're a lot better than I thought they'd be at this point right now. And I think they're a team that um, – what Baca's skill set is one that's very unique, and, and I think it would – he can knock down a long-range shot. So if they're looking to spread the court, even with some of their bigs, he can get in into the flow and hit the three-point shot. We know they love to live by the three-point shot. Yep. He can work into that. But also, I, I would bring him on and say, listen, when, if there's an open three here or there, that's great. We want you to take it. We want everyone to shoot the outside shot. That's our culture here. But he's also a guy that while the other guys are worrying about the three-point shot – a team like that needs a guy like Patrick Beverly. A okay. team like that needs a guy like Serge Ibaka that can go back to his heyday when he first got in the league and he was Serge Ibaka and more of a defensive force, uh, uh, you know, a lunch pail guy, a guy that was going to go and control the glass, go after rebounds, contest shots, defend well. I think Houston needs that. If they're going to compete with the San Antonios and the Golden States of the West and, and be one of those teams that maybe can get through the West and win a championship, yep. I think they got to add something in, in, uh, in this pre-deadline time. Ibaka could be a guy. And the other team that comes to mind that is good, playing great right now, but just not good enough in the big picture to win a whole thing, it's Washington. I love the way Washington's played, yeah. Yeah. but I think there's a lot asked of Marcin Gortat. You know, he's not getting any younger. He's played well, but he's asked to play a lot of minutes. And with Nene and Gortat, you're looking at a, a front court of guys that are just long in the tooth. And if you can bring some help and some minutes – to help Gortat out, yeah. um, it, it'll go a long way. We know they're pretty full in the backcourt. We know Otto Porter and, and, and Kelly Oubre and some guys on this team are playing well. But to get a true big man in there to spell Gortat or play long Gortat if they want to go big on you, yeah. I think Washington could be a good fit too. So East Washington, West uh, Houston, both teams that are good but not good enough to get over the hump without some addition at the deadline, and that's why I like the fit there. We'll see how it all plays out with the deadline right around the corner.